What's up? About to go to Boston. I love Boston. As a Southerner, I got a soft spot for Boston because I've always felt like culturally they take the heat off of us every now and then. Like, I just feel like if there's a family feud question, which part of America is known for being racist and talking funny? Sure, the South's going to come in at number one, but Boston is a solid number two, though, and I appreciate that. But I don't entirely relate to Boston. Boston's kind of like a, you know, a tale of two cities, and the other half of Boston is very moneyed and dignified and educated like people you mentioned boston to people they might think of the departed but they also might think of ben franklin and harvard you know like the south we don't have that second thing at all like the best we can hope for is that maybe people think of nanner pudding and forrest gump aka weaponized diabetes and a fictional simpleton that's the best we can hope for right but still i think there's a lot of overlap between like boston trash and southern trailer trash you know there's a lot there i mean you know in both, people still smoke cigarettes, get regrettable tattoos, play lottery scratch-off tickets. They got mamas who are always talking shit about some other person's kid getting arrested. Dad's always using a screwdriver and cursing God. You know, every summer the family takes a trip to the same damn beach, Cape Cod, or, you know, for us, Myrtle, PCB, Redneck Riviera. Spends the whole time getting sunburnt and fighting drunk. Comes back madder than when you left, right? Both sides still got people that'll gladly call into a sports radio station on a Monday morning and commit a verbal hate crime live on the air because a 22-year-old didn't get their toes down in bounds, right? I, I do have to say, I kind of, I don't know where y'all get off bitching about sports in Boston considering the success you've had, but I mean, we got that in the South too. They're called Bama fans, so I understand. Just like us, people think y'all are backwards. You know I mean? Even your most cultured, respected export Matt Damon. Even that guy just stopped using the F slur like two years ago. You remember that? He said he had officially retired that word from his vocabulary. Hilarious way to put that. I always imagined him in a garage in Boston just sadly hanging a patch jersey from the rafters with that word on the back of it right beside a faded Celtics jersey with the N-word on it, parliament in his mouth and a tear in his eye. So funny. Despite all that, people in both places intensely proud of where they're from while also incessantly bitching about how hard it is there. Have a massive chip on their shoulder about other people thinking they're better than them. For Bostonians, it's the crosstown yuppies with the boat shoes and the vineyard vines and stuff. For Southerners, it's the whole entire rest of the Western world. But still, we get it. I love Boston, man. I love how, like, unique and old Boston feels compared to most American cities. There's parts of Boston, dude, you get hammered drunk, you just feel like putting on a powdered wig and yelling at British people for even liking tea. It's great. It's an awesome place. I can't wait to come back. So y'all come see me this weekend. It's going to be fun. Love you. Bye.